Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can create Wii video assignments in Schoology to be able to view your students' submissions and grade it inside of Schoology. So first, I'm going to start in my Schoology course where I like to create the assignment, and I'm going to go to the Add Materials button. Here, I'm going to select Add Assignment. In the Create Assignment box, I'm going to complete the details just like any other assignment. In the description, please add as many details as possible for your students to create their assignment. So if you have specific guidelines like the duration of the video or what it should include, please have that in the description. You will need to assign a due date to your assignment so that students are able to submit that through WeVideo. So this is one of the requirements for that. It has to be a date in the future uh, for the due date. So in this example, I'm just going to do April 30th and I'm going to give it the standard default time, 11.59 p.m. Here you're going to give it the points for your assignment. You can assign it to a category. And also very important, you want to leave this submissions option enabled. So it is on by default, so you won't have to do anything um, to it. So just leave it on. Now I'm going to go ahead and turn on my comments to keep students from posting anything in that area. And I will go ahead and just click Create. So now I have here at the very bottom of my course the assignment I just created. So now what my students will have to do is they will have to sign into their Schoology and they will have to access WeVideo from their Schoology course. So this is one of the key instructions that you must give your students when having these WeVideo assignments in Schoology, that they need to access WeVideo using this link in Schoology. So I'm going to go ahead and click on the WeVideo. WeVideo will open in a new window, and I have it here. And now I can go ahead and create my video for my assignment. So as a student, I can go into create new, I can create video, and student will continue working on their project here in this window. So I'm just going to uh, create one really quick. I'm just gonna add this video footage. And now let's say I, as a student, have completed this assignment. I'm ready to submit it to Schoology. I'm going to go up to the top right corner where it says finish. I'm going to click finish. I'm going to give my video a title. So we video submission. I'm going to set the title and they will see the Schoology option here in the destination. So I'm going to select Schoology and in the drop down, I'm going to select the assignment that it's going to. So you may have a few or he or she may have a few, but I'm going to go ahead and select the one that corresponds for this video. So I'm going to select with video assignment, click OK. Then I will go ahead and select export. And depending on the size of your video, it's how long they're going to have to wait. So now that the submission has been completed, um, I'm going to go back to the Schoology page and view that submission for my student. So here I am in the Schoology course and I'm going to go find that Wii video assignment. So I'm just going to click on it. And on the right hand side, just like with any other assignment submission, I'm going to see the list of students that have submitted their assignment. Um, and I can go ahead and click on the name of the student to view the submission. So I'm going to click on that student's name and I'll be able to view the video right here in Schoology. I can make this full screen to view it better and I can go ahead and click play to play this video. 
uh, from here, I can go ahead and click escape to go back to the other screen and I can assign it a grade here at the top right corner. I can provide a comment here. I can show that to my students and then I can go ahead and submit it. I can also add comments here on the right hand side, just like with any other assignment in Schoology. All right, so I hope you enjoyed this video and until next time.